Hi, welcome back to Good Day. I'm with Uncle Bernie and Auntie Cheryl. Here's a cool thing before we teach you about onions here. Cheryl and Bernie went to see Kenny Rogers, Thunder Valley last night, and he normally throws out tambourines, and yes. you got one. Yes. And it's autographed? Yep, it's autographed, not even stamped. It's real autographed. How many total do you have? This is five. <laughs> there you go. Kenny Rogers, final tour, and she gets a tambourine. Thank Yay. you, Auntie Cheryl. Thanks yeah. for letting us be here today. Uncle Bernie, you said these onions here, the better ones are the flat the ones flat. versus the tall ones. Why is that? Just better flavor. Yeah. The flatter they are, they always say to flat, look for an onion, the flatter they are, the better they'll taste. Okay, let's, let's take a note on that. Remember, people, the flatter they are, the better. <laughs> Okay, um, so what is this with the pantyhose? Well, here's the seeds. If you leave them go in the garden, the little black seeds start to come out and you they'll just fall Let off. them go to seed, meaning just let them... Yeah, let them go. That onion we just showed, yeah. next year in fall, it'll sprout. Okay. That'll be my seed onion. It's the biggest, and sure. it'll, it'll make these. So then you got a flower there. And then I got a flower, and if I let it go, they'll fall over the ground. So we take the pantyhose or nylons or whatever, <laughs> cut the toes out, the feet out, and put them on the onion. They take a little old Bernie's favorite tape, yeah. electrical tape. Mm -hmm. Tape it like this. Okay. Well, let me hold this one. Yeah. Tape it like this. You notice my hands don't work very good anymore. That's running the jackhammer too long. You tape it like this. And then you just let it on the onion for a while. That's how we used to do it. Okay. Till I saw Michael you, Marks yeah. tell me how to, the guys in Calusa did it. So now I just yeah. pick them, put them in a tub upside down, and I'll have to put pantyhose on them. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, they just fall off by themselves. They fall off by themselves. When they get dry, you can shake them and they'll come off. Or I just put them in a tub and then I rub my hands over them and blow the stuff off with a fan, and then I have the black onion Boom, seed. you got the sheet. Yeah. When is the best time to plant the onion seeds? For the sets, you plant them in the dark of the moon in August. Wait a minute, what's dark of the moon? Well, my mother said you got to plant them in the dark of the moon for they won't go to seed on you. My onions usually don't seed. I don't know. End of August. Yeah, my mother planted by the moon. I plant by the moon. I've never had no problems. Here's a bee going by. Okay, see, we've got these big old bumblebees that we wanted to show you really quick. Scott, can you see any of these? This is green beans right up here. And you said the honeybees don't like them, but the black bees, Bumble the bumblebees. Bees. Bumblebees like them when they, I don't get beans on until I see the black bumblebees. Oh, look at all on the On all the other flowers oh, and stuff, are. you see the honeybees. But for some reason, they don't, they don't like the beans. There you go. Well, there you go. Tips, gardening tips from Uncle Bernie. Once again, we learn how to uh, use pantyhose. Wait till you see the bees pollinate the flowers. And remember, flatter the better, the better. when it comes to onions. Oh, <laughs> onions. Oh. The more Thanks, you Uncle Bernie. Know. Thanks, Uncle Bernie. Thanks, Uncle Bernie. All right. Thanks, Tina.